day two here in San Diego. Now, yesterday we did a ton of cashing out and I plan to do the same today. Try to hopefully spend every single last dollar in this bag, trying to get some steals and deals today. But before this video gets started, I wanna let you guys know a couple things. Number one, we have the Good Chefs restock happening. Uh, we had it in the last video. We're gonna have it again in this video. Hit the link in the description down below to join the waiting list. I'll go over more features later in this video. Number two, we're gonna be at Kaisa store off the bench later today, doing a podcast with them and then just chopping it up with them at the store, so stay tuned for that. And number three, we gotta do a fit check, Bry. So up top, I've got the Bound by Soul tee. You guys can shop these on boundbysoul.com. I've got the unreleased Common Hype Fossil Rose shorts right here. And then on the piggies, just some neutral grays today. My feet hurt a little bit from yesterday. Drew, what do you got on? Drew, right. come out. Oh, uh. <laughs> the background just waiting. Went a little different today, went a little comfy vibes. Got the foam runners on the bottom. The socks are good, they're good, and I keep wearing them, so I think they're pretty good, right? You got the front black shorts on, the common hype ones. Those will be dropping in the next collection. And there's the Harley T today with the common hype hat. My sunny's out here, because it's real sunny. All right. All right, we'll start down with the piggies today. Pulled out the bread ones. Just gonna wear the black toes again, but I think I got my event wears out of those for a little bit. I got some khaki linen pants for 20 bucks at H&M. Great summer pant, nice loose pant for the summer. It gets hot out here. And then I got the vintage Harley cut off right here. Some jewelry, that's about it. Very nice, anything else? No, I think we should go cash out, get some deals today. We got a lot of deals yesterday. I even bought a couple myself. That's how you know we got some good deals. I'm excited to get back out there today. Maybe get some personals today, do a little vintage run. Any lowballing with you and Brian today or no? I don't know, man. It's been lowballing with Brandon all weekend. They've been itching for it. They've been missing it, so. Might have to bless them with it today, Drew. All right, we stay tuned. It. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We do. That's what we're trying to find. Got you guys. You're the man. Was it 110, right? Yes, sir. And 110. Appreciate you, man. Thank you very much. Oh, yeah. Appreciate it. You guys going to be at Sneakercons uh, next week? We won't. No? We're going to be home and then we'll be at uh, Kais's event. Kais's yep, Kais's the week after. Right? Yep, that's all right. So we got a size nine. New Balance this is the one Drew's got stolen from him because he can't seem to keep track of his stuff. So picked up another one. Shout out to the guy right here. Yeah. Appreciate it. Appreciate Straight it. to the toes, bro. Were you guys here yesterday? I think I saw you guys here yesterday. We were. Yeah, yeah. yesterday was a great day for us. Yeah. What size are these and how much are you looking for? I think this is 10 and a half. Okay. Ones. My friends want 500. Yeah. Okay. Tell your friend I will pass. <laughs> um, uh, nine and a half. Okay. A lot of nine and a half. 350? 350. Dang, new pairs don't even. Tell your friend. Offer, offer. You can offer too, bro. Oh, it's okay. Um, I'll, 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 we'll be too far off on those. How much for the bleach corals? 220. Damn. Okay. Is this your side? Yeah, swing on my all side. All right, yeah. How about I come to your side? <laughs> swing on my Jeez. side. So from here to here is all worn. How much are you asking on these? Uh, 320. You guys bought a highlight yesterday? Um, yes, we did. Yeah. More than we usually do, quite honestly. On these, would you do uh, 260 on? Leave me enough room. I could bump up to 270. That would be my best on these. 280. I'd have to be firm at 270. Put that on possible. Put it on pause, yeah. What is that? That's a, a five. Uh, that's a nine, I think. I'd be at 420 on these. How much are you out on these? Uh, 950. I'd be at 850 on those. So you'd be at 850 plus 420 plus 270. You'd be at 1540 for all three of those. I can do that. This one. Uh, to okay, one. okay, cool. We'll take that. We tried, but after all that, it's okay. We came to an agreement on one pair, lightly worn Royal size 10 and a half. We just picked up a brand new Royal thank you 10 boys. and a half for 270. So thank you very much. Thank you Appreciate guys. the business, man. Handshake, handshake. Thank you very much. How much are the UNC mids going for? I'd be at 10 under ass for them. Depends on the size, yeah. I'm being kind of high before the restock. Oh, I gotcha. Cool, thank you. What's 10 under ass? like 140? 145 on some other sizes. Just kind of depends. Yeah, you got like 143 is average. Six and a half, seven, seven and a half, eight, eight and a half. So five pairs, right? Yeah, I'll do one for you. Cool. Come all right, so 700 for all of them? Cool, sounds good. So this is a great shoe, UNC Mid. Kind of tanked a little bit since they just recently restocked. They'll sell really well for us, so. How much? I'm asking 320. Oh, like 260? That's what I said. All right, 265. 265. 265 and 50 cents. I mean, I could do 270. These are down. What is that market right now? Is that bad? Oh, uh, I think market's like, they're at three. So we're in a recession right now, right? <laughs> Can't be charged the moon right now. Hey, you're rich. No. I didn't like that, bro. Rich with happiness. Am I right? No. 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 Flip a coin? No. I don't no. flip coins. I don't carry coins. Oh, yeah, I'll, I'll do one. Or two seventy. Did you take anything else? 
Ah, well, that was difficult, so I don't know if I want to <laughs> keep going through that. How much are these? Retail. How about under retail? How much under retail? I don't know. What is retail? 132. See, you probably had a Foot Locker, used a discount code, homie hooked you up with the 35% off. So <laughs> 80 bucks would work for you? That's that's too low for me, bro. Uh, 100 bucks? 120. No. No? No. What's the market? I have no idea. I'm just literally just going off topic. You're buying these right now? Yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll buy them. I, I think they're cool. Is this uh, not cool? Ladies yeah. in the comments, let me get, I, I like them. So I'm at 120, you're at 100? Yes. I see, I see, I know what you're trying to do. Just be in the middle, I know. I'm staying out 100 bucks on those. I'm gonna hold my ground. How much? Three. Three hundred. Where's market right now? How about 280? That's just 280. I heard my soul with that. And the stain, you're trying to tax me in their stain? Where's the stain? Unreal. That's his, that's his. I don't think that's my pair. That might be your pair. Someone was eating. It's someone's pair, man. Get him for retail? Yeah. I don't even know. Did I have for retail? You did hit him for retail, bro. Sell me yeah. this stained ass pair for a good price. <laughs> <laughs> you paid one fifty. You, you forgot Union shipping. They charge thirty dollars for shipping. Yeah. Hey That's Union, I'm not complaining about the tax. You can ship me as many pairs as you want for thirty bucks a pair. Yeah. Right? I'll take them all. Tell your people to hit my people. So look, you're in them for one eighty. I give you two thirty. You're up fifty bucks. I'll be at me. <laughs> That's like my low no shot, man. <laughs> two seven. Maybe without the stain. <laughs> Search continues. Wait, no, wait, no, we're not done. I still have a deal. Just see phones to 270 then? Yeah. Okay. Any stains on this one? <laughs> Shouldn't be. That's 260? Thanks for the business, man. Appreciate Thank you guys you being cool too. Yes, sir. What are you asking on the uh, Lamellos? Uh, 380. That's how much those go for now? No way. I'm gonna go for a check, dude. 130 retail to that. Hey, Puma, hit me. I'm not paying that. All right? I can't do it. This is a Rick and Morty's, right? Huh? The Ricks? Yeah, Rick and Morty. That's why. Yeah, I don't even want to offer. I'd be lowballing you at that point. What would you offer on this? Uh, I mean, last sale's three. Uh -huh. Yeah, I mean, that's... If that's, that's any indication, three, yeah, okay. I'd be at three. Which is honestly yeah. actually not bad, but... It's not bad, no, that's, that's not bad. I think my offers are bad sometimes, but then I realize they're not that bad, you know? 160 on these? Uh, how much do I have? 220. It's pretty high. Is that 160? Can you do 180? No. Uh, kind of, it's a, kind of a tougher one to move, but yeah. is it good or is it ass? It feels pretty ass. I just sold ten pairs of those yeah. at the corals right now. Yeah? yeah. No, you already sold the corals? Yeah. 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 Somebody, somebody How many did you buy them for? One sixty. Nice. So I'd be at one fifty on those. I'd be at three and one sixty. I could take both the thunders. But ten and a half. I could do two ninety. That's nine. I could do two eighty, and that's what I would want. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Let's do one fifty. Cool. I'll take these two. It's good. It's a good little table. Yeah, three. I'll do it. Okay. All right, so just to recap this deal, picked up the St. Patrick's Day Dunk, size 10 for a buck 50. We also picked up two pairs of Red Thunder 4s in a size 10 and a half and nine right here. We also grabbed something I, you guys probably have never seen me grab before. Rick and Morty, Pumas. These go for a check now. And last but not least, we picked up a pair of Jordan 1 Low UNC Golf. So shout out to this entire table right here. We appreciate it. And I am officially out of cash. So if we keep buying, I'm going to have to sell our cash out. What are we, what are we looking for? Oh, brand new? Yes, sir. Sweet. Yeah, man. Cool. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Have yeah. a good one. So like I said earlier in this video, Good Chefs is restocking this entire Kobe swap meet weekend. And I wanted to let you guys know a few of the features that we offer here in Good Chefs. Now, number one, we are not a card group. We are predominantly a sneaker group, but we do do a little bit of card things. Recently, our monitors are the only group monitors that picked up on a timely manner for the Prism 2021 NFL restock on Walgreens. And our group clipped over a thousand total boxes of those, which translates to anywhere from twenty to fifty thousand dollars in straight profit for the group. We also just got a ginormous shipment of Bleach Coral Lows. The shoe, arguably one of the top Jordan 1 lows of the year. We picked up early pairs for members. They were able to grab full size runs of those for about a buck 60 shipped. So you're probably thinking, well, that's market. Yeah, they're also tough to find. We were able to have them early on release date and, we're in now, and we are now shipping those out to members. Early pairs, back doors, 
card stuff. We also do sneaker ad, ad investment advice with me, doing weekly voice chat calls where we talk about the sneaker market. I personally give my two cents onto what's going on, what I'm kind of investing in. You guys always get my investment calls first in the group, along with an array of additional features that we offer here in Good Chefs. Now, again, it is $50 you guys can cancel at any month, but if you truly put in the work, that $50 is going to turn into thousands of dollars for you guys, and that's not a joke. We have over a thousand members in the group, and each one of them gains value every single week that they are with us. So be sure to join that waiting link in the description below. Again, it'll put you at the bottom of the waiting list, but as we continue to let people in and as people cancel, we will let you into the group because there is so much value and there's so much money. People think that in the recession that it's gonna be hard to make money in sneakers. No, that's actually completely false. Even easier to make money as long as you know what you're doing. And if I can help guide you guys and if I can help some of our members make a ton of money during this sneaker recession, then that's what my goal is going to be and that's what I'm going to strive to be able to do for you guys. So be sure to join that link in the description below and we'll see you in there. It's been a minute since we've been uh, off the bench. Things have changed. I don't know if you guys remember in the last video that we were here that we did, but shoes were like this kind of just across. And we told him like, eventually it's gonna get to the point where we're gonna have shoes stacked right next to each other, kind of like how we do in our store. And here we are, what, four months, three, four months later? And it's six stacked months, like six months later. Six months? Yeah. Holy cow, things have changed, guys. A lot of consignors Business is good, huh? In. Our inventory has gone up tremendously, and this is just one of each size. You don't even, we took out GS for a lot of SKUs, so it's crazy. All because of consigning, too. Huh? Uh, consigning and us buying. Yeah, it's a big combination. Our consignment's not even open to the public yet. No, it's not. It's, it's wild. Yeah. What's been the best seller since we've been um, here? As Last time said, it was Jordan 9s, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Seriously. I don't know, those red nines be moving, but I'm just, I'm just kidding. Uh, best selling SKUs right now for, for women's, like in the mid section, these two are great. A UNC women's mid, uh, Canary yellow mid. Uh, for Jordan 1 section, like Rebellionaires, UNC 1s, uh, Pine Greens have been picking up again. On the 4 section, Military 4s, Infrared 4s, UNC 4s, Lightning 4s, it's a good mixture. And then on dunks, it's like pretty much personal preference since we have so much options. Are you finally but, moving foam runners? Yeah, foam runners are selling. Uh, pandas as always, paisleys have been great. Uh, these Kermits have been super good. Team Reds have been great. And then for like SBs, these Phillies have been amazing. Right. Bart Simpsons, Paras, the Paisley Brown SBs, these are great. Yeah. Somewhere over here. In the Yeezy section, foam, slides, 350s. And then for like grails, trophy rooms have been selling like pretty consistently with the blue laces. Really? Sold a few cause fours and then like off-white lot dunks. Nice. Which has been good. So in a location like this, this is not a mall front. I mean, typically, you don't have to give me the exact number, but anywhere in a range of how many shoes you're moving per day. Um, in downtown, old town San Diego. I'd say we're moving over a thousand skis a month. I can't really give you like an estimate sure. per day, uh, just because it, it can be mixed. Right. Like one day it could be extremely busy outside, the other day it couldn't. Yeah. But uh, averaged out, we're selling a bunch of skis. Yeah, volume, man. It's a volume game, yeah, really especially when you have like consignment. You need to do volume. Right. Um, but we're creating like a good experience. Sales people and like the people who work with me, our morale has been up and. Right. We just don't want to have like a cool experience when you walk in, whether you leave with something or whether you don't. You don't yeah. And you guys added this whole section. We've got one of these too. Uh, so just for infant stuff, yeah? Yeah, just toddler, for toddler, preschool. infant. Um, we wanted to like, kind of remove these from the wall because like it can be misleading if it's like a 3Y on display right. and somebody sees like a dunk for a hundred bucks right. when it's a 3Y when like a GS is 150. So we kind of wanted to keep it separated, but this allows like parents or kids to see what's available in their size. Right. On Instagram, you've been posting a few celebrities that have come through. Yeah. Most recently, uh, we had Steve Aoki. Steve, Steve was big in there. Uh, John Summit. I'm a fan of John Summit. Sure. We had Neo. Uh, Neo. Neo there's Neo one was. too that I don't know if we could mention that I didn't even know about till after the one we had to sign an NDA. Oh yeah, I can't talk about that one, but just stay tuned on television, guys. Dang. There's a big one. That's coming. crazy. Yeah. I'm stoked with the process. I can't believe six months has flown yeah. by. Yeah. And I feel like Great yesterday job. we did our grand opening, raffled off a bunch of stuff wine out the door so i'm just excited for what's to come yeah we definitely yeah. got to do something big for the one year or 
maybe even something during summertime. Comic Con's coming up too, which is going to be right. big for us because it's literally across the street. It's yeah. huge. We got so. Comic Con, and Twitch those guys Con. Have Twitch Con is going to be huge. Oh, Red. Oh, what is that? <laughs> Twitch I'm Con serious, is going to be those guys in, I think like late September. October. Dude, we might and have to bring y'all out for TwitchCon and yeah, do a Twitch pop Yeah, TwitchCon is here. dope. I'm gonna do like a 24-hour yeah. live stream in here. What do you guys think? <laughs> lock the door. Yeah, lock the door. 24-hour live stream. <laughs> Tom, I'm proud of you, man. Proud of you. Oh. Thank you. As your proud sons. Appreciate we appreciate it. you. Thanks, Dad. We just want to be like common hype, you know. Yeah. We want to be the common hype of, of San Diego. Yes, sir. So don't open a store out here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's not gonna be one of the locations we open. You Shorts all over San Diego, right? It's all good. Off the bench, Arizona coming soon. Oh, <laughs> <I'm not bad. laughs>